And it was 10 years ago that Georgetown teenager Rachel Cook vanished after a morning jog. Friends, family, strangers came together to search for the teenager, even raising a $50,000 reward. Today, they gathered to commemorate the 10-year mark. As our Dustin Blanchard reports, they still have not given up hope. We may not have found her, but we know where she is. Thanks to you guys. Thank you. Rachel's parents thanked the volunteers, who spent countless hours searching for their daughter a decade ago. There's some people here we haven't seen in eight or ten years, and it's, it's very good. Volunteers like Marie Chaudhry. It was like every weekend we'd do a search on Saturday. I thought she would be found much sooner. That's what you're, you hope and pray, that she would be found sooner. It just never occurred to us that we, ten years later we would still be wondering what happened. I'm saying if I knew where she was, I wouldn't be looking. Police say hundreds of leads later, they haven't given up. Neither have the cooks. You don't give up the hope. I mean, as small as it may seem, she's my daughter. They took time to remember Rachel and to share that hope. I'll never get those 10 years back, but I wouldn't mind having another 10 with her. But the cooks say, most of all, they just wanted to thank those who got them through the last 10 years. People came and put their lives on hold while uh, they, while they look for Rachel. It doesn't get easier, but when you see these people here, it lights a light, and that light still burns. In Georgetown, Dustin Blanchard, KXAN News. Hard to believe it's been 10 years. Rachel Cook would be 29 now, and there is still a $50,000 reward for information that would help find her.